new at 11 o'clock face to face with a tattooed intruder wearing only boxers. A famous MMA fighter forced to defend himself in his own home. 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco was in the Midway area with how he avoided a potentially deadly confrontation. Rachel. Kimberly, this could have easily escalated. Dean Lister lives and works here along Midway Drive, and tonight he is trying to find the man who he says ransacked his apartment. Dean Lister is known as the boogeyman in the ring. The jiu-jitsu champion has taken down opponents around the world, but he wasn't expecting a fight when he went home to his apartment Saturday night. I thought someone was working on the apartment, but I was wrong. I came in, it's, it's weird. Lister says the man, covered in tattoos and wearing only boxers, wasn't making sense. Yeah, but why, why are you in here? Because I thought this was a, uh, a church. He says the guy asked him for meth. I said, yes, yes, I do, as a joke. And he went, really? And I, and then I knew it was, uh, something was, it was really fishy. He says when the man realized he was recording him, he grabbed a hammer. Are you really recording me now? Hey, man. At that point, Lister says he accidentally stopped the recording. He had a gun nearby and he grabbed it. He froze up and he said, please. And I'm like, yeah, you know what? I'm not going to shoot you in the back. OK, <laughs> but you know, you're in the wrong place, wrong time. Lister says the man had his back to him, leaving out the same window he crawled through to get in. When police got here, the guy was gone. Well, I'm not trying to sound like any kind of saint, but I mean, whatever, any kind of money I lost, maybe it's not worth, uh, you know, someone dying. Lister posted the video on YouTube. He hopes someone will recognize the man. I'm glad he gets a second chance. Hopefully he turns his life around. He says he thinks he has an idea now who that man is. He plans to give that information to police tomorrow. Reporting live in the Midway District, Rachel Bianco, 10 News.